All right, Shalom, I'm Akin. Before we get started, want to give all praises, glory, and honor to the Heavenly Father and His Son by their true names, Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah, Ba'ashem, Ha'ar and double honors to the elder apostles of Great Millstone who rule and teach well, and honors and salutations to my Akin, my Great Millstone, I'm pushing this truth, Shalom. And uh, I wanted to speak on this uh, article right here, um, which, you know, this it says, Leader of radical black only militia NFAC believers in violence and once a real life Wakanda for every black person in America. All right, so these are uh, you know, Jake's you know, living uh, in Babylon the Great. All right, that's you know, they're they're sick and tired of oppression, but they're 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 uh, you can't respond, you can't fight fire with fire, you know, you can't come. At the most, at the devil himself, the so-called white man, you know, who create, who, uh, well, Yahweh shot, you know, uh, uh, put, put it in the heart, you know, of the so-called white man Esau, you know, to uh, gave him that blessing. Matter of fact, you know, gave him that blessing, you know, to create these these weapons. Jake is holding in his hand the sword. This the modern day sword. All right. And that's the blessing of the so-called white man, given, you know, from Yahweh Bashem All right, it says, uh, so what Jake is doing is carnal and is going to lead to death, which through the scriptures, all right, we're going to prove that what, uh, what these Jakes are doing, you know, is going to lead them to destruction, all right? And this the will, this the will of Yahweh Bashem because every, uh, all of, you know, all, uh, Two thirds, you know, of our people who are Israelites, you know, is the Lord don't want them to receive His truth. You know, He don't want them to be saved. So, through various ways, you know, Yahweh Shemashah is going to get rid of two thirds of His people. You know. Uh, all right. So they've been they've been carnal, which you know you can read the article on your own. I'm trying to, uh, you know, get straight to the scriptures. All right, but look at the title. It said, "Leader of Radical Black Only Militia NFAC believers, I mean, believes in violence and wants a real life Wakanda for every black person in America." And we're not black, all right. <clears throat> These are different uh, bowers and you know that we that uh, you know and stigmas that have been put on you Israelites, you know, like black, you know, uh, uh. You know, black, Hispanic, and Native American. These different by words you've been going by, you know, are uh was given to you, you know, by the so-called white man. All right. And these even even down to these these uh these names you got these slave names you got last names and all that. All right. <clears throat> Which are our home home tongue, our original tongue. You know which we fell away from. You know uh, is Hebrew, Paleo Hebrew. You know which you uh, you're supposed to rehearse when you come in this truth. You're supposed to rehearse. That's called rehearsing the righteous acts. You know when you learn in your home your home language and stuff like that, and where you come from, and where you going. You know, uh, I just go going down. It's another scripture too that says, uh, "Seek the old path, and you may find life." Roughly paraphrasing that way. All right, you know which are that's you know the scriptures is give you an example, you know of how to be you know uh, a righteous Israelite of Yahweh Shemel Shah, you know. Uh, For inquire, pray thee of the former age, and prepare thyself to the search of their fathers. All right, because you know you Negroes, Latinos, Native American Indians. All right, your forefathers are uh, Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. You know, and you know this this the Bible is you know a book about you and for you. You know, only. Uh, let me go back. It says, uh, Proverbs 3 and 5, Trust in the Lord, Yahweh Shemeshah, with all thine heart, and lean not unto thine own understanding. 
All right. So don't be in carnal and trying to, you know, fight fire with fire. You know, that's leaning on your own understanding. And you're not trusting in your Shah. All right. In all, in all thy ways, acknowledge him and he shall direct thy paths. So you should be, uh, you know, seeking men of the Lord, you know, beginning with the elder apostles of Great Millstone on down to the least of us that's breaking down, you know, the prophecies in the Bible for you. Seeking, you should be seeking answers in this, uh, you know, this time we in because it's crunch time, you know. And you should be, uh, you know, learning his word as quick and as much as possible, you know, before the famine of the word come before they shut down YouTube and all that and we ain't gonna be, be able to use this uh you know this platform to push out this truth all right worldwide um let me get the next one first Corinthians 14 and 37 if any man think himself to be a prophet or spiritual let him acknowledge that the things I write that I write unto you are the commandments of the Lord all right, so that's how you supposed to take uh, what we saying serious, you know. Romans uh, eight and six to eight for to be carnally minded is death, but to be spiritually minded is life and peace. All right, us as spiritual, you know, men, we we think you know with reasoning and logic according to the law, statutes, and commandments, you know, of Yahweh Bashmiyah Shah in the Bible. Because the carnal mind is enmity against Yahweh Bashem for it is not subject to the law of Yahweh Bashem neither indeed can be. So they, so then they that are in the flesh cannot please Yahweh Bashem all right? Because you got two thirds of our people, they relying on, you know, physical means, you know, like, uh, uh, phys like physical force. They trying to take things to their own matter and, and get things done, you know. Uh, so to speak, you know, all right, which that's going to lead them back to for it to be carnally minded is death, you know, because Esau, he's not about to play with you at all, you know, he already got the perpetual hatred on his mind, you know, so he about to, he going to sling, you know, you already know how he coming, uh, Romans 13 and 1. Let every soul be subject unto the higher powers, for there is no power but of Yahweh Shemashah. The powers that be are ordained of Yahweh Shemashah. So the people that sit, you know, the so called white man, you know, and, you know, the elites of Esau, you know, this whole beast system is set up, you know, was ordained by Yahweh Shemashah. All right. And Yahweh Shemashah is taking it down. All right. We just, uh, Doing what a prophet does, you know, all right, bringing out the word and prophecies and judgment of Yahweh Shemesha, and he's going to bring it all to pass, you know. Uh, whosoever therefore resist of the power, resist of the ordinance of Yahweh Shemesha. So we not about to come against this, uh, against the so-called white man, you know. We just going to read out of the Bible, let him know what's coming on on his kingdom, you know, and. Preach the gospel to the healthy elect, you know, and let, let, uh, you know, the other nations and stuff and two thirds of our people know the judgment that's coming on this place. That's all that we supposed to be doing. Um, all right, whosoever therefore resists with the power, resists with the ordinance of Yahweh Shemesha, and they that resist shall receive to themselves damnation. So you over with by trying to come against, you know, the so called white man. All right. <clears throat> now, once you know you help us, uh, uh, give us those spiritual powers and things like that, you know, and we on the uh, chariots and stuff like that. He, you know, you help us, Shah gonna give us the command to, uh, you know, come back down here. All right, and uh, you know, enslave these other nations. You know. Enslave Esau, the so-called white man, Japanese man, all right, the Ammonites, all right, that's their biblical name, the Chinese man, the Moabites, that's their biblical name, and these other uh, nations that had us in slavery, all right, and we're going to put them back in slavery. So, you know, is you going to wait on Yahweh Shemel Shah, you know, 
to revenge you, because vengeance is is of Yahweh by Shemel Shah. All right, but you got you got Jake trying to avenge himself. Uh, that was pretty much it on that. I wanted to make it short and sweet, you know. But Lord willing, that was edifying. You know, I want to give all praise and and honor to the Heavenly Father and the Son by their true names. Yeah, true name. Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah, by Hashem, Hawa Kakwadash. And double honors to my elder apostles of Great Millstone, who rule and teach well, and honors and salutations to the Akim of Great Millstone. Alright? Kwam Yashal and Baba Baba.